Uh, Commissioner, you've um, committed yourself to a review of the multi-annual financial framework in 2016 um, in order to focus the cap spending on job creation. Um, is that review going to go ahead? And my second question, the voluntary couple support of the European sugar beet sector had an unforeseen development in the latest cap reform. The, this support affects 21% um, of annual EU sugar consumption, which is around 17 million tonnes plus. And it's clear that this will put further pressure on imports of sugar to the European Union from farmers and communities in the Global South who rely on these imports. And I wondered if you would be willing to instruct your officials to have a look at how much the voluntary couple's support could lead to further reductions in imports of sugar to the European Union. Thanks. From that point of view. I have set up a, an expert group to look at the sugar industry in the context of the uh, quotas being terminated in 2017. So some of the issues that you might have will be able to feed into that particular process, uh, Mr. Brennan. Also, I would remind you that voluntary couple support is available under the Rural Development Programme for every member state if they think that there are uh, particular products that are under stress or farmers are under particular financial pressure. So it's a matter for the member state if they wish to do that or not. Um, in relation to milk in Portugal and 